Hey, what's up guys and I have a breaking news for you all. Google just made the Fuchsia OS website live and that means you may see the operating system really soon at least for testing. This website is owned by Google so it's official. It's having the same schematics and same design language like the Google's Android developer website. The one which is having the firmware and documentation for Android beta program. So it's kind of official only in case you're not aware of what Fuchsia really is. So this thing is an operating system which is based on zircon kernel it's not based on linux which android uses so it's a micro kernel zircon previously known as magenta it's something new but may run the android apk files that's nice now fuchsia os is not only for phones or laptops it's also for smart speakers smart tv car and so on so it's basically a huge thing that google is working on for the future now you may be thinking how the website can help you getting the Fuchsia OS on your system. So it's having this set of documentation which you can take help from. It also explains how Fuchsia works. You can just set up the build environment, boot into Fuchsia and enjoy. So it's currently supported by a limited hardware devices which includes Google Pixel Book, there's Intel NUC and Acer Switch Alpha 12 which is likely discontinued right now and previously Google was testing it in the Huawei Honor device that they discontinued later on so that's all guys right now we can only test this thing so that's a huge progress guys I think Google is officially moving towards revealing the future operating system the website is now live and so will be the official screenshots and all in the future by the way at Google I.O. 2019 Google said to the Verge no this is not the new Android or this is not the new Chrome OS it's a different operating system which may see in near future in variety of devices like smartphones smart TVs and speakers etc and the next major news coming in from 9to5 Google and XGA Google is working on fast share which is kinda like the airdrop for Android so it uses Bluetooth for fast sharing so it's not using the Android Beam NFC it's like Bluetooth transfer but it's gonna be fast and it's an in internal testing in the Google's file application so we may see it in near future so that is all guys the Google Fuchsia OS is coming really soon and so is the Android Q I'm just waiting for this thing to boot on a smartphone so that we can install it and take a look at it by the way as I said Google is one step ahead and they have already started working on the Android R so if you want me to make a video on Android R let me know in the comment section right now. So thanks for watching. I'll meet you guys in the next one. Peace out.